Hello everyone, this is uh, Dr. Perdian, uh, your professor for General Chemistry 2 CHM uh, 1046. I just wanted to create a quick little video to get you started in the course, show you around our D12 shell a little bit uh, so that you can get going right away in this uh, sort of quick uh, session three course. All right, so we're here at uh, our Broward.edu webpage, of course, uh, to get into D12 if you never have. Uh, the quickest uh, way is uh, either to follow that link I'll send you in the email or just click uh, the login uh, link uh, at the top right corner of the page. Now I've already logged in so you won't be able to see that step but you'll just uh, log in using uh, your username and password to get into the, our uh, Broward College One Access system. From there you're going to want to click uh, the D12 uh, icon uh, for Desire to Learn course shell when that opens up, uh, when, it, when that opens up, there's usually some, you know, updates or announcements uh, from the college. And if you scroll down a little bit, you get to see all of your courses you're taking at Broward College. Uh, here's our course that starts today. Uh, so you'll just uh, click that icon, and it will take you to our course. Now, the main things uh, we're going to be doing in here is. Um, well, you're going to be uh, following links to all of our video lectures, uh, taking our assessments. Uh, we've got quizzes, exams, and homeworks uh, that we'll all be doing in D12, uh, as well as, uh, you know, following along with a lot of content here. Uh, each week, I'll post an announcement that will basically go over what uh, we're going to be working on each day. Uh, to keep, uh, uh, you know, uh, on pace, I'll show you what lectures you should be watching each day in the announcements tool. Okay, along with the reading assignment for each week. Now you can uh, use the OpenStax books, which uh, is a free uh, open uh, resource, uh, educational resource that we have uh, here. Or if you took, uh, you know, Gen Chem 1 here at Bar College and you've got uh, Pearson's uh, Chemistry and Molecular Approach by Tro, uh, that book is, uh, you know, of course, a really good one as well. So you can use either book the free OpenStax book, which you can find here in this textbook. We've got either a link to take you out to the website or the PDF here. Or, of course, again, you can, uh, you know, read uh, the Chemistry and Molecular Approach by Tro. Okay, I'll uh, post each week the reading assignment. Uh, this is also in the syllabus. Uh, then for each day, uh, we'll, show, talk, we'll uh, give you a schedule for what lectures you should be watching. And it is a really good idea to try to uh, stay on track with the lectures that I post each day. Um, this would just mimic what we'd be doing in the lecture had we been meeting face-to-face. Uh, -face. And so that you don't get uh, behind in this, uh, you know, uh, session three course, uh, you want to make sure you're keeping up with the schedule. So each day, uh, you know, set aside some time and maybe the actual time that we would have been meeting, you know, 1230 to 1.45, uh, to watch these videos. Uh, there's going to be several videos each day, and that's only because, you know, I broke down these uh, video lectures uh, down by concept and, you know, to keep them shorter. So each video is only about, you know, 10 to 15 minutes uh, in length. And so there's a couple ways that you can follow along with these lectures, either in the announcements tool that I uh, post, or you can also go here to the content on D, uh, D12. I also have a video lectures uh, section, which I've got a um, just a sort of uh, page for all of the playlists. By, uh, broken down by unit. So our first unit is thermochemistry. You can watch them here or you can go break it out to the YouTube uh, page to see all of the um, videos in the playlist. Um, so what is thermochemistry? So in general chemistry. Okay, and so here they are. And so definitely uh, follow along uh, the schedule for video lectures. Uh, if you want to take notes while you're watching the videos, I've posted uh, the PowerPoints that are used for those videos. Uh, in uh, our D12 shell. You can get that uh, by just clicking, let me go back to the course home, uh, the video lectures notes uh, folder uh, in the content browser. So here's the video lectures notes. Here's all the uh, PowerPoint files that I use. So if you want to you know, print them off and sort of follow along at home, you certainly can do that. Or of course you can, you know, just, you know, take notes um, on a piece of paper. 
But you definitely want to try to treat this as a regular lecture, even though it's uh, remote. Definitely pay attention uh, when you're watching these videos. Definitely watch all the videos. Take notes just as you would in class uh, so that you're uh, you know, prepared for the homework uh, assessments, quizzes, and exams. All right. So uh, along with that, the other things you'll be working on the first week is that we've got a syllabus quiz. So I want you to read the syllabus, and that's under Syllabus and Resources. Uh, there it is. So read that very, very carefully, uh, and you'll take the syllabus quiz. Uh, we In the syllabus quiz, you also read that we will be using the Honor Lock uh, proctoring system for our final exam. It's the only assessment we're going to use it for, just the final exam. Uh, and so you do want to test your system so that uh, you're prepared uh, for when that uh, time comes. And so in the assessments, there's two assessments that are going to be due on uh, Sunday. That is the honor lock system check and the syllabus quiz. So a couple uh, ways you can get to those assessments and any assessment is you know under the calendar, uh, you can see when things are due. So the syllabus quiz is due this Sunday along with the honor lock system check. Our homework isn't due until next Wednesday, um, but that's uh, viewable here as well. So you can click on any of these links and that'll take you to the quiz. Or you can go to assessments quizzes and tests and that will take you to all of your available uh, quizzes and homeworks and whatever else is available okay it probably looks a little bit different for students uh, than the instructor um, but that's another way you can get to the uh, quizzes all right so um, let's hop into the syllabus just real quickly just to show you uh, sort of the assessments I definitely want you to again I would definitely want you to read this very carefully uh, but just I'll show you the breakdown of the schedule for the course. Um, we'll be meeting on Blackboard Collaborate on Wednesdays at 1 p.m. to go over the week's units. So each day you'll be watching the video lectures and starting to work on the material, reading the textbook. Uh, these meetings each week will be our time to uh, sit down and sort of discuss the material, as well as uh, definitely the most important part is answer your questions. So make sure you, uh, you know, come with some questions to these meetings so I can help you out if you're not understanding uh, something. Uh, if you do need to meet me for office hours, you can we can meet in Blackboard Collaborate and uh, just email me for an appointment. And then here is the link for our Blackboard Collaborate session. So definitely uh, just need to click that uh, to get there. Here's another link to the OpenStax textbook if you want to use that textbook. Last day to withdraw from the course is July 1st, next Wednesday. And then uh, last day to withdraw from the course is the 23rd. There's my email ad address. That's the best way to reach me uh, if you need to get, uh, if you have a question or just uh, need some help, uh, definitely reach out to me via email. Uh, here's our assessment. Uh, we have three exams in the course, uh, two exams and a final exam, eight homework assignments, and then two quizzes. The exams are worth 100 points. Uh, the homework and quizzes are worth 10 each for a grand total of 400 points. Then underneath that is just uh, more information that you'll need to read. Um, basically, uh, you do have to take that honor lock system check and syllabus quiz. Uh, let's do this Sunday. Um, and you can't start working on the first homework assignment until those are done and completed. And you gotta get 100% on the uh, quizzes to move forward. Uh, so as I said, uh, all of our quizzes, homeworks, and exams are uh, administered uh, in our D12 shell. The homeworks are pretty much open all the time, so you can go in and out of those as much as you want. The quizzes and exams are open from 12 a.m. to 11.30 p.m. Uh, on the dates listed below. Uh, basically, the quizzes are on a Monday and Tuesday, open Monday and due by Tuesday. And then the exams open up on Friday and are due by Sunday uh, at those times. You get to one uh, attempt per assessment. And so um, you definitely uh, want to um, think about that when you're doing your homework. Um, the homework is there's no time limit for the homework. So you get to work on that as much as you want, but you only do get one attempt. Uh, for the quizzes, there's a 20 minute time limit uh, for the quizzes and then one hour and 20 minute time limit for the exams, okay? Uh, so you definitely need to take those within the, that time frame. 
There's a BC's excused absence policy. If something does happen, um, you miss a quiz or exam, just you know, reach out to me as soon as you can. Uh, here's more information. Uh, so there's a final exams being proctored uh, using honor lock. So you definitely got to um, read the honor lock module and then take the honor lock system check before Sunday uh, for more information on that. Um, and then here's our lecture schedule. So here's, uh, you know, broken down by week. Uh, here's the topics that we're going to talk about. The reading assignments in both of the textbooks, depending on which one you have. You know, uh, the OpenStax one that's online or Tro's um, book. And then here's our assessment schedule. All right, so you can see when everything is due, uh, when it opens, um, and, you know, all that uh, information. Okay. Uh, so just, you know, in the short term, you know, we got the, the syllabus quiz and honor lock system check due Sunday. Then our first homework is due on Wednesday. Second homework is due on Sunday. Okay, and that pretty much um, is the pattern for homeworks. One's due on Wednesday, one's due on Sunday. Uh, then we have our first quiz the week after next, um, which uh, the quiz opens on Monday and its deadline is Tuesday. So you do have a two-day window depending on your schedule. You know, some, some days are better than others for, uh, you know, individuals. So I wanted to keep it open, uh, you know, at least two days. And then for the uh, exams, I open up three days. So they're open, uh, available on Friday and due by Sunday. And our first exams starts on July 10th, due by that Sunday, July 12th. Second exam, uh, July 17th and our final exam uh, opens up on the 24th and it's due by the 26th and again all of these are in D2 well all right so uh, just more information about conduct accommodations if you need some stuff uh, you know uh, accommodations through accessibility resources uh, you know, there's their phone number if you do have trouble with some material, um, again, I do have, you know, you can reach out to me for uh, an office hour appointment uh, via Blackboard Collaborate. Um, but uh, the North, North Campus is also offering a remote tutoring. And so you can click this link, and there's also a link in our content folder in D12 to schedule an appointment. Okay, so they got remote tutoring uh, with tutors. So just the uh, same as, you know, the resources that are available to you had we, you know, been meeting on, on campus, uh, they're available to you in a remote environment. And so here's that website for that. We also have tutor.com, and here's the link here, and then there's a you know, website. There's also a link in D12 that I can show you for additional tutoring opportunities. All right, so that's the, you know, the short version of the syllabus. Again, I definitely want you to read through this uh, very, very carefully, and uh, definitely reach out to me if you have any questions on that. All right, so what else is in our uh, D12 shell? So we've got our announcements that break down, uh, you know, video lectures we'll be watching each day. Uh, again, if you uh, want to go back and watch other uh, videos, here's the video lectures um, a module that contains all those. Uh, I showed you the um, playlist, but there's also a PDF of the video links. Uh, in its entirety. So if you do need to look back or you want to start watching forward, here's all of the links for all of the um, units that we're going to go over. Okay. And then on the right side, I do tell you how many minutes each lecture is. Okay. Um, just, you know, if you, if you want to know, if you need to know that information. All right. So back to our course home. So we've got our videos. Uh, we've got a module for our textbook. Here's all of the information you need for your honor lock proctoring. So I want you to definitely look through that, um, read all of that information about our final exam and how it's going to be proctored. Uh, the first two exams and quizzes and homeworks, those are not proctored. So those, of course, would be, you know, open notes, open resources. Uh, but the final exam is going to be proctored. It is going to be, um, so you won't be able to use any resources. It's not open book. Uh, you will get an equation sheet, which I do have under syllabus uh, and resources, and here it is, the 1046 equation sheet. So this is what you'll be getting for the final exam, and so this is also probably a good resource for you to keep out while you're working on problems. Um, these are all the equations we'll use during the, co during the course, and so you'll need these for the homeworks and quizzes. Okay, so here's all the equations. 
and then we also give you a periodic table. So if you need a periodic table, um, there's also one posted here. All right, so uh, read through that honor lock information. If you have any questions, um, let me know. Um, and uh, video lectures, yep, and our textbook, okay. So um, that's pretty much our D12 shell. I want you to you know, start looking through this information, read the syllabus, read the honor lock uh, proctoring information. Um, then of course, just get started uh, you know, reading uh, our first unit uh, on thermochemistry, which is in chapter five of OpenStax book, chapter seven of Tros, and then start watching these videos. All right, so that should be uh, enough to get you started. Uh, if you have any questions uh, for me, reach out to me via email and uh, we'll be uh, meeting here uh, in Blackboard Collaborate each Wednesday at 1 p.m. See you then.